welcome back guys i hope all of you will be fine so this is question 5.20 and the statement of this question is according to usa today march 18 1997 of 4 million workers in the general workforce 5.8 percent tested positive for drugs of these testing positive 22.5 percent were cocaine users and 54.4 percent are marijuana users okay so on the basis of this data we have to find that what is the probability that of 10 workers testing positive two are cocaine users five are marijuana users and three are users of other drugs okay so here we can see that we have more than two categories which are the categories of the cocaine user okay let me represent it with c marijuana users let me represent it with m and other with o okay here we will have the total number of persons 10 which are tested positive and the people we want to see are the cocaine users are two for marijuana we have to see five while the remaining one are three here okay out of these what are basically the probabilities for them for it let me represent it with p of c and this is what is given here 22.5 percent which is 0. 225 okay the probability of marijuana users are basically what the probability for that is of 0. 0.544 okay and the remaining one is here which is for o so for o are basically the other ones so here it will be 1 minus p of c plus p of m okay what it would be let me calculate it p of O it would be 1 minus P of C is 0 0.225 plus 0 0.544 okay so it would be what it would be 0 0.231 okay so this is here we have okay so now on the basis of it we want to find out the probability and here again we have to use the multinomial probability law so let me calculate it, the probability that we will have two cocaine users, five marijuana and three other users. So it would be what? It would be the N factorial divided by C factorial, M factorial, O factorial multiplied by what? Multiplied by P of C raised to the power C, P of M raised to the power M and p of o raised to the power o let me write their values so here it would be 10 factorial divided by 2 factorial multiplied by 5 factorial multiplied by 3 factorial and multiplying with them the values it has so the probability of c is 0 0.225 and c is 2 so square similarly p of m is 0 0.544 and it is 5 here and 0 0.231 and the power it has is cube okay so now here we have these values now calculating it and finding out the answer of it we found that the answer of it is 0 0.074 9 and that is what that is basically the solution of party of our question okay here it is given now on the basis of the similar data let us calculate or find the answer of the part b of this question what is the probability that of 10 worker testing positive all are marijuana users so means we have the marijuana users total number of positives are 10 and k which are 10 are basically here and these are the marijuana users so marijuana users are here and the probability of the marijuana users is here so let me have this one as p so this is 0 0.544 and we can see that this is the problem of the binomial probability because here we have only one category either a person will be of marijuana user or not okay so this is the binomial probability only one category has been given so either a person will be of that category or not okay so let me find it out so it would be the probability that k is equal to 10 okay finding the values here and using the same formulation as we did previously so it would be 10 factorial 
divided by this category 10 factorial and other category 0 okay the probability of this category is 0 0.544 and is power 10 and the other one would be what it would be q okay so q would be 1 minus 0 0.544 so the answer of it would be what 1 minus 0 0.544 would be 45 6 0 0.456 okay so let me write it 0 0.456 is power 0 okay so calculating it these two will cancel out this would be equal to 1 so it would be 0 0.544 raised to the power 10 so the answer of it would be 0 0.0023 okay and that is what that is the solution of part b of my question okay so for solving part c let me move down somehow so the statement of part c is what is the probability that of 10 workers testing positive none is a cocaine user okay so here if we have the total number tested are 10 so none are basically what the cocaine user so others are others would be 10 okay so here the probability of the cocaine users is what that is here 0 0.225 and not cocaine users would be q so it would be 1 minus 0 0.225 which would be what which would be 775 okay 0.775 so now in order to find it out again this is again the binomial probability so we have to find the probability that k is equal to 0 again using the same formulation that 10 factorial divided by 0 factorial and other categories are 10 factorial okay which is same as 10 choose 0 okay as here we had this one and it was 10 choose 10 okay so we have covered all these topics in our binomial probability distributions uh, so here the probability of it is 0 0.225 raised to the power 0 because of here and the other one which is q is 0 0.775 raised to the power 10 okay so this is what we have in order to calculate it these two will cancel out it would be 1 so only we have to find this one which is 0 0.775 raised to the power 10 and the answer of it would be 0 0.0782 okay so that is what that is basically the solution of part c of my question okay so uh, that's it for today in which we have seen three parts the first part was there this was part b and this was part c okay in all of these parts we have seen the usability of the multinomial probability distributions and how to use it how to find different probabilities so that's it for today if you have any question you can ask me in the comment box see you soon